right, guys, in this video, we will uh, basically strip the rear half of the car, hard lines. So first start with uh, dropping the, uh, the fuel tank. Um, had drained most of the gas out of the, the fuel tank before um, I parked the car, so there wasn't a lot of gas. I made a mistake last time on the parts car of uh, having too much gas sloshing around. Um, after dropping the fuel tank, I uh, loosened a couple of the hard lines from up front. Um, don't show a lot of video of that because it's kind of boring. It's a, a lot of work just taking nuts and stuff off. Um, but uh, took all the hard lines loose from the front of the car and uh, then obviously dropped it, dropped the uh, fuel tank uh, straps that hold it up along with uh, basically um, e-brake lines and all the other hard lines on the car. So um, eventually we'll get to the uh, the tie bar, I take the tie bar off, um, sprayed it down. Luckily the, uh, the back side of the nuts are open so you can spray it down with the lube. I think that helped a lot with the nuts. Um, but I've got a uh, kind of walk through that actually live and, and have audio for that. So um, I'll, you'll see me walk through it, but uh, it physically breaks in half. So kind of interesting. Um, but uh, anyway, look for uh, more updates uh, coming soon. Thanks. Being welded to the uh, chassis here, I'm trying to take a little bit more precaution than uh, normal to make sure that I don't uh, screw them up. But uh, for the most part, I wasn't too concerned because, like I said, the uh, well, obviously, the bar was doing a lot of structural strength to the car. And again, we knew that that was the uh, rusted through part. But at the same time, did not expect it to, uh, to break in half. I mean, just uh, completely rusted through. And, uh, you know, it uh, was in really bad shape. Hey guys, hope you enjoy watching the restoration of the Rusty Barnacle, uh, Integra Type R 98111. Um, please subscribe and uh, keep looking for updates. Thanks.